Good morning, everybody. I am Chris, and we are doing a 50-minute arms and obliques workout. So I'm going to call it the bat wings and love handles workout. I know I'm by myself, and I know you expect that Amanda's going to come flying out dressed as Taylor Swift, but her son was sick, so she called out this morning, which opened up a whole new idea of um, conversation today while we work out, the whole calling out thing. <laughs> we miss you. Amanda, all you need today are dumbbells, okay? We're starting with the obliques. Everything's going to be one minute. Then we have all upper body segments after that, only dumbbells. This is going to be good. It's going to be quick. You're going to love it. And we're going to talk about calling out of work and how that feels. <laughs> okay. All right. So we're going to get ourselves warm. Good morning, Miss Regina. Good morning, Jackie G, Amanda. Ah, oh, roll your shoulders back. Good back. Good. Keep going. Back. Thanks, Joyce. Back again. All right. Marta, June, Margie, Katie, Kathy Campbell in the house. Good. Now, how about we swim? You're going to swim and swim. Good. Some people are like, this lady's nuts. Yes. Keep going. Keep going. Eight more. And eight, seven, and six, five, and four, three, two. In the front, you're going to crisscross crisscross and tap so let's just start ourselves going up here okay okay we're going to warm up your body and then we start with obliques let's go <laughs> i know those ab moves we did yesterday for 10 minutes holy moly i definitely feel that today come on <laughs> getting swole miss trudy ah four more you have four three two now stop and twist twist by the way today is March 1st, which I don't know if all of you know what that means, but that means we flip the calendar. <laughs> You're like, yeah, duh. <laughs> okay, look at this. See this? See what I'm doing? You're not doing that. You're twisting through your waist. Okay? Twist through your waist. Don't move your legs. Good. Good. All right. Now you're going to add the arms. Add the arms. Good. So tight and strong through the middle. Good. Good morning, Miss Donna. Oh, we got lemons in the house. Good. Who else? Who called out today? Anybody called out? Good. And decided to work out with me instead. And seven, and six, five, four, three, two. Now, right arm comes up, left arm under. I want you to reach. Reach. Okay, so reach past your right hip with your left arm. Good. And good. Yeah, that's right, Kendra. Keep going. Keep going. While you're doing that, I'm going to take the calendar flip. Good. <laughs> no, keep going. You ready? Pick it up. A little pulse. Go eight, seven, six, four, three, two. Hold it. Now slowly switch arms. Slow motion for me. Here we go. Slow. Good. And slow. Nice. Oh, here comes my Momoa. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Uh, Nastia wanted me, she, well, Nastia was going to be the backup for Amanda, but she actually had a meeting today, so <laughs> no fun facts today. That's a fun fact for you. <laughs> Come on. Keep going. And over. Good. A little pulse. Ready? And pulse. Pulse. Don't move your legs, just your waist and your arms. Come on. Come on. Oh, eight more of those. Go eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, big breath in, take it up. Exhale, hands, not yet. Roll it up for two and down for two. Good, again. Daniel, Laura, Paula, Jess, Sandra, good. And up, up, and down, good. <laughs> up, down, nice. Up, good. All the way up for four, it's four, three, Two, take it back down, nice and slow. Now right here, you're gonna drop your right shoulder two times. You're going two, good. <laughs> Kevin said, Carla, that was a good one. Fun fact, if you do this move, you'll be able to tell if you need deodorant. <laughs> Come on, and down, down. Oh, Donna, yes, I can't wait for that. Good, good. <laughs> good. Hold it center, fun fact. Kevin does not wear deodorant and he does not smell. 
roll, good, <laughs> good. Okay, we're going to the floor. We're going to the floor, but before that, goodbye February, hello March. Okay, <laughs> there we go. You're like, can we just get to the workout? Yes. Ready? We're coming down to forearms, and we're gonna do a twisting plank. Hands are apart, toes. What you're gonna do is stack your feet in one direction, keep both forearms down, back to the center, and then the other side. This is a minute. If you need to take breaks, you take them. You do the best you can. You ready? All right, Nicole, here we go. So you're gonna go side, center, good. Side, now you're twisting from the navel down. Okay, you're on your toes. Good, twist, good. And again, forearms stay in place. Now, if you're like, I can't do that, okay? Maybe you just hold a plank. Maybe you stay on plank knees. All of that is okay, all right? So the first time I did a plank, was I able to do this? No, right? But you work toward it and take modifications. Good, keep going. Good, over, nice. Keep it strong. Hitting those obliques here, good. And your feet, you wanna be way up on your toes so that you're, you can stack your feet one on top of the other. Okay, if you're too far back here, like if you're on the ball of your foot, you're gonna slide. So you really want on your tippy toe and stop, good. Okay, now come to your right elbow. If you, have a, if you need a little cushioning under your booty, then get it there. Okay, option one, left hand behind the head, right leg forward, crunching here. Watch what you're not doing. Okay, so your elbow comes down. Both knees are an option or straight legs, but that would be two and two to make it a little bit more challenging. And here we go. So here's option one. Look at it again, look again, I'm not doing this. Actually take your hand from behind your head. Actually, if you want to, actually, let's do this. If you're doing it with a knee, reach that left arm up. Ooh, that feels better. Okay, if you're doing these, both knees. Okay, that way you're not pulling on your head at all. Or straight legs, two up, two down, up. Throw a little love out to my newest monthly supporters, Jenny S, Lisa M, Jennifer. Thank you, thank you. Up, good, and down. Oh yeah, come on, up, and down. Nice, so you're on that soft spot of your butt here. Good, keep going, take it up, up, and down. Nice, good, and down. Again, we will miss, we do miss Amanda. There's something totally missing without Amanda here today. <laughs> and down, it's so quiet. Good, stop, good. Right to the other side, right to the other side. So again, let's do it with the reach. Okay, you ready? One minute, here we go. So here it is with one leg, okay. Here it is with two. I'm oh, sorry, it'd be singles. Good morning, Melita. Ready? Straight leg if you want. Two and two. We go. Up, up, down. Let's go. And up. Good. Down. Stay with it. You don't want to sink into this shoulder. You see this? Lift out of it. Lift out of it. That, all, that right away grabs in those obliques. Good. Keep going. And up. Woo! And down. So when I was teaching classes, I started, you heard me say this before, I started teaching classes when I was 16 and I was so irresponsible. Anybody that knows me from back then and in my 20s, I was like so irresponsible, I called out all the time. And the excuses that I had were completely ridiculous. Keep going, and up, up, and down. Keep going, up, and down. Now go back to your right side. You can stack your knees for this if you want, but make sure your hips are stacked. Or you can have one leg out, or you can have both feet stacked, okay? You're gonna go reach over, come back. So it's a reach over with a dip. Ready? Here we go. And up, good. So the count is two and two. Kevin, Kevin said, don't be surprised if I start using that excuse and call it, calling out. Good enough. <laughs> National, oh, that's right. And fun fact from Nastia, it's National Employee Appreciation Day. Yeah. Good. I can't say 
I mean, I already made Kevin breakfast. <laughs> this is no different than any other day, really. Come on up. Oh, good. Lift up your hips. You should be feeling the obliques in the underside, so your right side, yes? Up, up, down. Come on. Now, if you're like, Chris, I just can't hold myself up with my arm, then take a break, okay? That's okay. We're doing these first, so that way your arms are completely dead when we're doing all of these, okay? One more, one more. And stop, switch sides. All right, Deb Landis in the house. Woo, good. Okay, you ready? <laughs> and here we go, ready? So we're up, and again, you can stack the knees if you want. <laughs> so it's so funny because since, so since I have not uh, taught in a gym now in quite a while, anybody who's an instructor <laughs> knows the pain of trying to find a sub when you're sick. It is not fun. Good. So most of the time at a gym, I don't know if you guys know this, but most of the time at a gym, if you're sick, you have to find your own sub. So if you're really sick, you're calling, like the gym hit most gyms, most places I worked, don't do it for you, right? So up and down. If you're sick, you know, cancel your class, you either gotta do it or you have to call around and find somebody for an hour. <laughs> Come on. And up and down. Good. Up and stop. Okay. Now, stand up and grab one dumbbell. I'm going to use a 12 pound. Okay. Last oblique move here. I'm going to use a 12 pound. Okay. So, right toes forward. Le sorry, right toes point that way point toward the wall. Left toes point toward me. Right hand has the dumbbell. Legs are straight. So your right heel is going to be lined up with the arch of your left foot. Left arm is up, and you're gonna go side and up. Ready? Here we go, we're going down. Now, if you're like, uh, I don't think so. Okay, another option is to do a side bend. Okay, now, in this position, you wanna imagine that your back is straight against the wall, okay? So, if you have trouble with that, you can do it without the dumbbell, okay? The back of your right arm is sliding against the right leg, okay? Come on, down and reach that left arm straight up to the sky. Down, and up, good. And down. What did Jerry say? Go up a little bit. Good. Come on. Ah, good. Ah, I miss. I can't find it now. Good. Good. You're always the sub. Oh, Jerry. <laughs> I wish I had you so many times. Good. 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 You taught class sick. Oh yeah. And stop. Are you kidding me? <laughs> so, Nikki said you taught class sick. Oh yeah, many times. <laughs> They don't care. Ready? And so left foot that way. Right foot faces me. Left foot toward the wall. Ready? Here we go. Down. Good. Yeah. Good. Which is funny. I had a bad, I had a dream last night about my my favorite gym owner and his wife. Come on. And, um, not a good one. Come on and down. You guys can think that whoever whoever has whoever that is. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, good question, Regina. I feel it up here in my right obliques on this one. Good question. And uh, good. Right, it's, you know, you, like, so just says same thing with teaching. It was more of a pain to find a sub than just suck it up. Yeah, especially for an hour. You're like, okay, fine. I remember teaching class, not being able to teach and sitting on a stability ball because I hurt my back. Good. And down. And up. Good. Keep going. Down. Ah. <laughs> and down. And up. Woo! All right. Oh, yeah. You ready to move on to arms? Obliques should be happy now. Okay, so first segment is chest press. Then we have a pullover. 
and then a standing wide row. So we do each move 45 seconds and repeat. So I'm gonna go uh, for my chest press, I'm gonna go 25s, okay? Chest press 25s, pullovers. I'm gonna use two 20s, but you can use one heavy one if you like. You know, I'm gonna use two 17s for the pullovers. And then I'm gonna stick with my 17s for my wide row. Okay, we'll get into the, the form and everything when we get there. Okay, so, oh crab. All right, oh Jackie, I know it's not fun, right? I was like, man, that's not something I missed. Now I just, now I just canceled the class or put up an old one. <laughs> okay, ready? So palms face away from you. We're doing super slow. You're gonna go four, three, two, and back up. But we're gonna move to 45 seconds on these calves. You ready? Here we go. And four, okay, three. Now I know I said this before, so if anybody's new, I'm gonna repeat because it's important that we know this. When you come down, your wrists and your hands are over your elbows. So you're making, so look at them. They're making 90 degree angles, okay? Once you look at them and make sure that's happening, put your head back so you're looking up at the sky. Good, end up, nice and slow. All right, your dumbbells end up above your elbows, not above your shoulders. Good, come on. Stop, good, elbows down, rock yourself up and switch it out to my 17s. Watch this, you can use one dumbbell, or you can go two. These are also gonna be super slow. You're going back, now you might feel those abs here. Arms are just slightly bent the whole time. Okay, so this is not a skull crusher where you're doing this. This is arms go straight back and up, okay? Ready? Four and four, here we go. Four, three. Okay, nice and slow. Squeeze the dumbbells together. That will also give you some chest work, okay? Good, back, two, now, try not to arch your back so you are working your core here. And you've heard me say this before, what I love about this move is you're working your lats, okay? You're working your chest by squeezing the dumbbells together in an ISO. You're working your triceps and your shoulders, okay? If you have trouble doing this with weight, do it without the weight to work on your range of motion. That's really important, right? Keep going. Good. And stop, good. Bring yourself up to standing. I'm actually gonna lighten, I'm gonna do 15, okay? And I'll tell you why. Okay, so I'm gonna go 15 pounds. Now, when your palms are facing behind you, there's a lot more likelihood of you rounding, okay? So, you really wanna focus on not rounding. Pull the shoulder blades back and you're gonna pull wide, okay? So look, it's like this, wide, okay? Okay, so, and I might even go to 12 if I have to. You wanna show that, Kev? <laughs> Watch, look, 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 wide, and then down, okay? Ready? <laughs> Here we go. One, down, two, three. <laughs> So I was moving the camera the other day for the wall set, and I was like, I kind of like that. I kind of like that angle. Good. Come on. Nice. Now, if you're feeling this in your neck more than you're feeling it in your upper back and the back of your shoulders, lighten up. Okay? <laughs> you're missing Amanda. <laughs> Amanda, come on now. <laughs> Amanda, <laughs> Amanda, <laughs> good, Everybody keep going, keep going. Oh, we could have a whole 20 minute conversation about Amanda if you want. Stop, <laughs> shake it out. <laughs> Kevin said she would like that, let's do it, let's do it. We're going again, chest press, okay? So get down Everybody, tonight, okay? And if the weight was, if it wasn't challenging for you, go up. If it was too hard, go down, make choices. Challenge yourself. Okay, ready? Come on down. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> we have Bob Barker and Chuck Wooler right here. Are you ready? <laughs> Whoo, four and four. Here we go. And it's four, three, two, 
back up. Good. <laughs> Come on down. Do and do. No, four and four. Come on. <laughs> and two. And three. Up. Oh, good. <laughs> you can have an hour conversation about Amanda. Let's do that. Give her <laughs> there we go. <laughs> we have 20, about a half an hour left. Keep going. <laughs> Keep your wrists straight. I want you to think that you're punching up toward the sky, so your knuckles go up toward the sky. Your rings, your knuckles, right? Come on. Woo. That's it. What? Kevin said he doesn't know what I'm talking about. Up, two, and three, and stop. Good, okay, Woo. So if your abs are sore from yesterday, you should probably be feeling all of this because you should be working your core as you're holding it. Good morning, Ronnie. Good. Oh, okay. Good. All right, you ready? And here we go. And back. All right, so we had a question there. Up. Oh, good. We had a question. Is it better to do chest work on the step bench? If you like it on the step bench, yes. And also, if you want to do it there, you can get a little deeper in a range of motion. So sure, you can do it on the bench if you want. Okay. Good. Uh, good. Now, the reason I do most of the workouts with floor, because I know not everybody has a bench. Okay. Good. Although a lot of you guys found me because of step aerobics. So that makes me happy that you're doing weights too. And up. Uh, I think we could squeeze one more in here, can't we? Yeah, back. Two. Three. Take it up real slow. You're not done. <laughs> and, and stop. All right, good. Come on back up. And we're going to one more round of your back. Now, this is the only round of back and chest. The rest is biceps, triceps, shoulders. Okay? Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, babe. Yeah, babe. All right. <laughs> Grandma Ron Ron. <laughs> would not want a sick child. Ready? Two and two, here we go. Up, good. Actually, let's do that one and three, one and three. Pull up, slow down, good. Now, this is a harder position to do that row. It's wide, okay? You're pulling it wide and controlling it down. There is none of this happening, look. None of this happening, because that is a surefire way to hurt your lower back. Softening your knees, pull, and down. If you have to do this, your weights are too heavy and you're doing it wrong, okay? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not trying to be a jerk, I'm just being honest. <laughs> and down, two, again, come on. <sighs> Jerry, I started at 16 and you started at 60. I love that, stop, it's never too late, right? Oh, what does Jerry teach? That's what I wanna know. All right, all right. You know what I forgot? I forgot my gloves. I'm gonna try them out. Okay, so we're gonna hit buys, tries, shoulders. Okay, buys, tries, shoulders. Put my gloves on. Amanda, you left yours here. Amanda was drunk last week, so she left her gloves here. <laughs> All right, put my gloves on. I got these for $3.99 at TJ Maxx. We'll see how they go. $3.99? I think so, something like that. All right, so first move we're gonna do ISO alternating biceps, okay? Then we do kickbacks, and then alternating shoulder press, which I'll give you options for, okay? So, I'm gonna do 17 for my biceps. Go a little heavier than you normally would, because we're alternating. Actually, no, go normal weight for this one. I'm gonna do 15, because this is an ISO, okay? So here, Amanda drunk, never. Okay, watch, you're gonna go down, up, down, up, okay? So holding at 90, these are 45, ready? Right arm goes, down, and then left, good. <laughs> Drinking gloves, good. And dim sum, good, <laughs> good. <laughs> I literally was laughing so hard all day at, co at Kendra's comments, like to myself. I think Kevin thinks that I'm, well, he knows I'm crazy because literally I'm constantly laughing at something either from a text message or earlier. Good. Come on. Nikki's working, Donna. Good. Woo! Come on. Oh yeah, these are fun. Good. Anybody feel your arms yet? Down. Good. So yeah, there's a tag on these and it's driving me nuts. I'm going to take it off in a second. Good. Ugh. Stop. Woo! 
Woo! I love that, Jerry. Cardio step, kickboxing, and stretch, 10 years. Awesome. All right, we're going to kickbacks. Kickbacks. I'm going to take this off. I can't help it. I'm going to use uh, 10 pounds on my kickbacks because I cheat if I don't. Okay? These are going to go back and then in. They're together. Okay? You ready? <laughs> and here we go. Back. Two, three, and in. Okay, and two, three, good. So think about squeezing your arms back. You're not doing this. Nothing is moving in the shoulders, okay? You're kicking back. I don't know if Ronnie's got her dumbbells in hand. Come on, <laughs> back, whew. Again, kick, good, good. Again, come on, back. We're doing each round twice here. Again, and back. Every day is missing Amanda day. <laughs> do, do, oh. <laughs> do. Give me one more. Good. All right. And stop. So now we're going to do an overhead press alternating. You're going to stay here. If you can't do that, alternate front raise. Always options. Okay? Or work on it without and just work on your, your uh, range of motion. Okay? I'm going to go 15. Now. There's an ISO there, holding it in place. Where's my other 15? All right, I'm gonna be here. Both arms, ah, there it is, it's right in front of me. Hold it, you're gonna go one up, and then the other side. 45, here we go, Kev. Up, good. Good. <laughs> right, exactly, happy Happy we do those ab moves first so that we're not doing those planks again, right, while, we're, while our arms are sore. Good, good. Ronnie, pick up those weights. Grandma, run, run. I don't care if you're using one pound dumbbells. Come on, you can do it. Can't she do it, guys? Can't can she dig it? Yes, she can. Come on, keep going. Come on, Grandma, run, run. Keep going. Uh, whew. Good. I, I know, Sandra. Good. Woo. You're almost there, guys. One more. Stop. Ho. Ah. Oh. All right. I love that, Jerry. We're doing those again. Assess the weight you use. If it's too heavy, if it's too light, if you can do it again with that same weight, if you have to go heavier or lighter. Why do I keep doing this? So I got my 15s again. Ready? And here we go. Down. And I want you to go slower than the beat. Now look what you're not doing. Okay. Don't let it pull you. And also another thing I see a lot as people feel that they want to squeeze this in, that was like a total like 80s thing. Squeeze your elbows to your side. What happens when you do that is you do this. So you want to keep them close to your side, but you don't want to squeeze them in because that will cause you to round your back. Okay, good. Good. <laughs> Ooh, that, well, Amanda, we're going to be dancing next week on Thursday, so. <sighs> there's a new, there, well, there's a new Miley song, Vern. <laughs> And there's a new Gaga song that's kind of good too. And stop, so we'll see what we can do. Okay, kickbacks again. Kickbacks again. Whew. If this position doesn't feel great for you, you can put one foot back. I like the kickstand. Thank you, Kelly. Elbows up. One back, three down. Go back, in. Again, I'm using 10 pounds here. The reason I use 10 pounds in this bent over position here, I find that if I go any heavier, that I round, okay? And I would rather work the triceps really focused than be in bad form doing it. Because if I'm rounded, first of all, if I'm rounded, I'm more likely to use my, my low back. Okay, now I'm in my neck, pull back, okay? Yeah, keep going. Back, whew. <laughs> Janet's mom's nickname was Ronnie, but I don't, she doesn't know how they got that from Rebecca. Good. Go ahead. Back. And stop. Woo! Okay. We got that overhead alternate again. Ah, your arms are going to be pumped. Are you ready? And you could alternate front race. Here we go. Down. Good. Um, that's like my friend Erica. Her mom's name is Marguerite, and they call her Gretchen. <laughs> 
That's interesting, right? Come on, good. Come on. Whew. And up. You got this. Good, good, good. Out of the neck. You don't have to. Don't lock those elbows. Press and down. And press and down. Are we out of music? Good. And press. Keep going. Abs are strong here. Good. Just hit the back. Uh-oh. Go on, dude. Uh-oh. He doesn't know how to use the app, so that's going to be fun. He's like, not with this DJ around. Uh-oh. And down. <laughs> He's pressing every button on the iPad. And good thing we're in a break. Okay. Take a break. Grab a drink. 25. Uh, I got it. I got it. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. All right. So next moves. Both twisting curl. And there's the option of doing it on your knees to work your abs a little bit more. Then a skull crusher. Okay. Then an upright row. And all those will be either on the knees or standing, whatever you choose. Okay. So I'm going to do these. Both arms. Okay. I'm going to go twisting curls up and down. Both arms. Okay. Ready? 45. Here we go. Up. Good. Can you do this standing? Absolutely. Do you work your core a little bit more on the knees? Yes. Okay. But you don't have to. Okay. Another thing, uh, you don't have to be on the knees. Another thing, when you're doing a twisting curl, stay strong in those wrists. Okay. BTS. By, by strides shoulders. Good. Come on. Come on. It's National Pig Day. What? Is <laughs> Good. Plant babies. Melanie from Montreal. Woohoo! Cal, Cali Cat. Good. Keep going. Mm. Nice. And stop. That's an even better one. Malcolm, nicknamed Andy. All right, so we're going to hit a skull crusher. I'm going to go 12 pounds. You can also hold one dumbbell by the ends if that feels better for you. If you're doing two dumbbells and a part, okay, if you're doing two dumbbells and a part, it works a little more in the shoulders, but if you have trouble doing that, then just hold one, okay, or hold them together. So ready? From the bottom, two up, two down. You're going up. Now, I like to keep the outside edge of my hand against the inside head of the dumbbell, okay, because that helps me from bending my wrist. You don't want to be bending your wrist side to side here, okay, because you're going to feel that more in the forearm and in the hands than you're going to feel it in your triceps. Now, where are your triceps? I'm just gonna, I know some of you guys are like, duh, but maybe you're not. Maybe you don't know where your triceps are. Here, that spot when you wave, that everybody's like, what do I do about that jiggle? That's the spot, bat wings, whatever you want to call them. <laughs> good. And, uh, good, good. I like the gloves. <laughs> good. And stop. Nice. Okay, so you can stand. I think that, Regina, I think that I need to get a bit, these were large, and like, I feel like my hands are puffy. Okay, so you can stand if you want, or you're going to go upright row, and we're doing one and three, okay? Ready? Keep it close to your body. One up. Here we go. So I have 12 pounds. Good. Okay. So keep going. Look at this. It's close to your body. It's here, okay? It's not... Don't arch your back like that, okay? So elbows lead, not hands. That's totally different. You want to be aware of your body, okay? Good. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> A maxinista. Good. I can't. <laughs> so, Regina. Keep going. So, <laughs> woo. Good. Come on. Good. Woo. Nobody waves after 50. <laughs> Donna. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> and stop. Whew. Shake it out. All of those again. Okay? Choose your weights wisely. You're either going to biceps. I'm going to go to 17 on my biceps. Okay? Mm. Yeah, these are all right. They're Adidas. My Adidas. All right. So <laughs> they're all right. All right, you ready? And... Here we go. <laughs> I call my son Louie, all different kinds of names. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. Try not to swing. You want to keep it nice and controlled. Good. Um, <laughs> and, uh, 
So Louie has lots of nicknames. Chubbs McGillicuddy, Lulu, Stinky Pants. <laughs> what else? What else do we call Louie? Whatever, <laughs> whatever. Anna's pretty much just out of banana, although sometimes I call her Poopsie because she's so cute. <laughs> uh, mm, these feel yummy. <laughs> ah, come on, come on, come on. And stop. Okay, 17 was fun. <laughs> Back to your skull crushers. Okay. <laughs> it's like that. Just wave like this so your triceps don't shake. Do that. <laughs> what, what movie is that from? And the Vaseline on your teeth? <laughs> what movie is that from? Like, how do I not know that? <sighs> do you know that, Kev? Austin Powers. <laughs> Are you ready? Two and two. Here we go, Chuck. Down. Up. Good. So the dumbbells come down right next to your ears. Okay. Down. Some people say they have trouble keeping their arms in position. Work on it with really light weight. Another thing you could do is put a, uh, a loop band around your arms to keep them in place. Okay. Up. Nice. <sighs> keep going. If you're not about to make that noise, like, oh, gosh. Come on. If you're not yelling sugar, honey, iced tea. Woo. Come on. Good. Go I'm going to start yelling. Oh, who's her, what's her name? Coco? Coco and iced tea. <laughs> on and down. And, oh, nice. Woo. Uh, holy but jeez. Okay. So back here. Okay. Any, anyone that has queen in it? Fun is a relative word. Your cat's name is Smirnoff. I like Jerry. Where are you, Jerry? <laughs> My, with a, I want to hear, okay, fun fact. Next week, we want to hear Nastia say the word Smirnoff. I like it. Yeah? Kevin said, yeah, that's good. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, up three down with your uprights. Let's all stand for this. Let's all stand. Let's all stand. Let's chant. But ready? <laughs> Here we go. We're going. And up, down, two, again. Good. <laughs> good. Anybody ever see the movie Drop Dead Gorgeous? <laughs> with Kirsten Dunst and Denise Richards? <laughs> what happened to her? Where's Denise Richards? <laughs> and, and Christy Alley, Ellen Barkin. Oh my God. So funny. Up, uh, good. <laughs> Cosmo. <laughs> I love it, Donna. Cosmo was a cutie. Up, uh, Ottawa. Ah, oh, Gary in Ottawa. Up, uh, good. You can do this, guys. You can do it. Come on. Again. And stop. Awesome. We have so much time left, it's not even funny. All right. <laughs> You're like, what? No, that's not true. Okay. So we're going to take one more round. This is not a bonus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what the heck was that? Okay. Watch. I totally uh, screwed up all of these rounds. Okay, <laughs> so <laughs> we're gonna go out, up, in, down. So in, so look. <laughs> Where'd you go? <laughs> out, up, down, in. Okay, ready? 45. We go out, out, up, down, in. Good, out. <laughs> Isn't that the best? Your five-month-old puppy is licking your forehead during Skull Crusher. We're not seeing Louie today because Jake is here, which means that Louie is literally like standing in front of him like, take me with you, take me with you. Good. What's that? He's lighting at the bathroom door. Oh my God, he's so cute. Good, good. So, oh yeah, you guys heard how Nastia says Schwarzenegger. It's like the way you're supposed to say it. Good. I was like, say that again. That's how you say Schwarzenegger? I love it. It sounds so much better when she says it. Good, come on. Woo! Ah. Stop. Cut. Front. Oh, wait a second. There's another. Oh, no. We're doing front, side, down, side, front, down. And then we'll do the tricep, okay? I'm going to use 10. Uh, I'm going to use 10 pounds. Okay? I know I'm probably going to have to move to eight, though. I'm going to do eight. I can tell already I need eight. All right, ready? 
So actually, let's go side first. Here we go. Side, front, and then back down. Good. Side, elbows are slightly bent. Out of the neck, good. Come on. <laughs> good. Yeah. Carrie Steven, Carrie Steven, arms on fire! Let's go, come on, whoo! <sighs> good. Keep going. <sighs> Even these little eights are tough today. Good, by the way, Janet, I saw that you did the abs from yesterday this morning. I want to apologize for tomorrow already. Good. And stop. Overhead. Slow extension. If you can't do that, you kick back some stead. Okay? Okay? I'm going to use one. I'm going to use one 17-pound dumbbell. Holding it by the end. Look how I'm holding it. Okay. We're doing two up, two down. Here we go. Up, good. And down, good. Extend, and good. Relax, relay, release. Good, come on. Good. So while I'm editing videos after class, I, do, I don't even know what station it is on um, iTunes. I just hit play the other day and it was playing <laughs> the most Strange mix of music. It went from like Chris Stapleton to like, um, what's the band? Stone Temple Pilots. And then it went to like uh, Drake. And <laughs> there was some like Outcast. And I was like, and Ta Taylor Swift and stuff. I'm like, what is this mix? I like it because I get to hear a little bit of everything. I like to try different things, you know? Okay, break. We're doing all that one more time. Can you do it? Yes, you can. Okay. So, what do we start with? <laughs> I'm kidding. In. Let's do it this way. Actually, I'm sorry. Out, up. I want the side curl. Okay. I'm going to do 15. In my big mess of weights here. I know, right, Donna? And arms of steel. Here we go. Ready? Out. Good. And in. Good. Stay focused. You can do this, guys. Up. Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Out. Up. Down. Good. I wish it was a tank top day around here. What do I say? But Amanda, it's always a tank top day around here, right? Come on. Good. And down. Nice. Last night we finished season two of um, Love on the Spectrum. And whoever said that they love Connor. Oh, I know. Come on. Connor. Oh, come on. Up. In. Good. Last one. And stop. Oh! Whew. Front and side raise. Audrey, I'm bringing your sevens out, babe. <laughs> Grabbing the sevens. I'm going to go a um, um, pound lighter. I always forget they're there because they're underneath the weight rack. Okay. Side. In. Down. Side. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> Jen, oh, Jen, I should have called you to come over. We haven't seen the beast in a while. Good, good. I saw her last week. Some of us got to see Jen. What a cutie pie. Good, by the way, Jen makes sourdough bread. So she brought over a loaf. I had to cut one of the one that you left here in half and put it in the freezer. Good. Ronnie was like, put that in the freezer and have it with some soup. I'm like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, babe. Go on, let's go. I'm just gonna talk like Amanda for the rest of the class. You wanna go to Starbs later? <laughs> totes, come on, totes wanna go there. Good. <laughs> Can I deliver my wine to your house? Come on. <laughs> oh yeah, babe. <laughs> oh, and stop. All right. Can you do it? <laughs> Can you dig it? I knew that's good. <laughs> Give me some gin. What's this? Tony Monero. Tony Monero. Okay, ready? Extension. I'm using a 17. Whoo, here we go. We're almost there, guys. Ready? Two and two. Here we go. I know. Jen's pretty amazing. There's nothing that any of you can't do. You guys can do it all, right? Come on. Up. Good. Good. 
up. Good. Donna puts her mind to a lot of things. Donna's like, I'm going to do that. <laughs> That's what I love about you, Donna. Go on, go on. I'm doing that. Good. Whew. And uh, yeah, Amanda is a lot of entertainment. <laughs> Good. That's the word of the day. Dig. Dig it. <laughs> I dig it. Come on. Oh, that's that's a good idea, Jen. All right. And stop. Oh. Okay. What's the real time here? Oh, good. Guess what, Kev? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I want you to grab one heavy dumbbell. I'm gonna use a 20. You got one more move on each side. Okay. It is for oblique. You can do this standing if you want. I like it on the knees because I find you a little more core work. Left hand behind the head. You're gonna go to the side and up. Okay, we're doing one minute, two and two. Ready? Here we go. And down. Good. And up. Nice. Down. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good question. Does anyone else do the bonus jump? Yeah, so Kelly, it was you that says you love Connor. Oh my God. Well, <laughs> okay, so again, for you, those of you who don't haven't seen Love on the Spectrum, it is people on the spectrum dating. And it is so good. But Connor specifically, in the beginning, he's so scared and so shy. What is he's like 28 or 29, I think, something like that. Right? He's in his late 20. And he's so adorable. And then you just see throughout the series this the season, like how much confidence he builds. And it's like, ah, uh, he's just you just your heart just like warms up. Yeah, it's on Netflix. Good. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Up. Amanda, I love you. Oh, those felt great. Okay, ready? You do the jump, Heidi. I love it. <laughs> ready? And here we go. You know, I'm just gonna pretend Amanda's here and talk to her. What do you think of this? What do you want to do after this? Keep going. <laughs> Good. Stay down to your side, right? So right down the side of your body. Good. Down. <laughs> Good. And down. Good. Up, good, and down. <laughs> I just absolutely, I love it. Keep going. And down, and Abby and David. Uh, you go down, good. And up. So if you just want to, and, and you guys know me. I don't watch heartwarming stuff. <laughs> I, I watch stuff where people are like ripping eyeballs out. <laughs> no, well, sort of. You know, I like a thriller, horror, mystery. I don't like like romantic comedies or anything, or dating shows typically, but oh my, I can't, I can't get enough of love on the spectrum. It is the best. Down. Anna, come on. And holy moly, yes. Okay, <laughs> have a seat, Stefan. All right, re actually, let's take the legs out, legs out. Ooh. Reach it over, hold it right there. Woo. Good. Uh, nice stretch through those obliques. Hold it. Good. So Janet, we took Jake and Ronnie to Alessio's last night. Janet and Seal. You guys have not. I'm going to give them a big shout out because that place was great. Bucks County. Doylestown, right? Doylestown area. Warrington. Warminster, that area. Alessio's. It's Seafood Grill. Oh, my God. Janet and Seal, it was even better for dinner. <laughs> Jake. <laughs> Good, hold it right there. Good, come up. So Kevin's dad was like, I want this. What was it called? Well, it was this. It was a, a seafood. I had like mussels and clams and scallops and everything. Pom oh, I can't even think of what it's called now. Pom Pomodoro or something. Somebody knows it. Somebody knows what is the Italian plate with every every piece of seafood on it. You know, vein popping. I love it. So Jake's like, oh, I don't want to get. That's expensive. We're like, Jake, get it, <laughs> get it, get it, right? Literally, the plate came out. 
and there was enough seafood on there. There was five of us for the whole table. <laughs> God, all right, come on. He was, his face was like, I was like, well, we could sit, we could go there and everybody <laughs> can eat off of that one plate. Lean it over, good. Oh, hold it. Not Fra Diablo. Uh, nope, you guys are close, nope. No, it's like, oh my God, it's on the menu. Why can't, you know why I can't remember it? It's because Ronnie kept saying it and going, I don't think that's how you say it. She, <laughs> she's so cute. Um, uh, pescatore, pescatore. Yes, there it is, pescatore. So that's what it was, okay? And holy moly, so good. Oh, Janet Lemons watching the first season of True Detective, so good. Gotta love some McConaughey, good. No, but a booyah base is delicious. Oh, we should go to Spanish food soon. Good. Okay, right arm across. Stretch it out. Good. Good. Hold it right there. <laughs> no, yeah. It's pescatore. It was delicious. Good. Switch sides. Poo poo platter. No, Joyce. Joyce, no. <laughs> That's not Italian. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's a, a sea, the, unless you have a seafood grill, let me say, is an Italian joint. And so good. I'm gonna. What's that? BYOB. Now you're hungry. Yeah. Good. Take it down. Oh, right there. Oh, Anna. Thank you, Chris. Wish you all a fine weekend. That's like R Pierre Robert. I wish all you fine people a fine weekend. Good. From the fine village of Pennsylvania, <laughs> Philadelphia. Good, up, oh, big breath in. Hands together and down to your heart. Fantastic job, guys. If you need more of a stretch, search my channel for upper body stretch because there's like 10 minute ones, there's 20 minute ones. There is something for you to look for, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. Mwah, bye.